So as you know, before we take the lesson about fraction one, it's what the meaning of a fraction, how we write and read a fraction, uh, how we reduce a fraction. And the last session about in the fraction two, in the lesson of fraction two, it's about how to add and subtract fraction. We take before how we add two fractions with same denominator. We say if we have same denominator, just we add what? The numerator. 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 I have here four, four plus five over 13. Just I will add four plus five. It gives me nine, nine. over 13. I will yeah. not add the denominator. Just I will add the numerator. 60 plus Eight. four is 10. Over seven. Also here it's four over eight. Here if I have same denominator, maybe I have two fractions with different denominator, like in this page. Look. To add two fractions, we are in page teacher in your book, page uh, 109, 110 now. Just I wanna read it. To add two fractions. Yeah. Having different denominators, unlike fraction, we have to reduce them to same denominator. But then we add them. So the first step is we reduce them to same denominator. How we reduce them to same denominator? To reduce two fractions to same denominator, you should get the LCM. And as you know, in the chapters before, we get the LCM by using the table of multiplication by writing the multiple of each number. For example, let's see, multiple of 4 and multiple of 3. Let's get the LCM of 4 and 3. 0, 4, 8, 12. Here I have 0, 3, 6, 9, 12. So we get the LCM of 3 and 4, that is 12. Today, today, I want to explain for you a new way to get the LCM and fastest way and easiest way by prime decomposition. I will explain for you what the meaning of prime decomposition. So to add two fractions with different denominator, we should reduce them to same denominator. To reduce them to same denominator, we should get the LCM. We should get the LCM by using prime factorization or prime decomposition. Now, I will give you an example about prime decomposition. Okay, how we get an LCM by prime decomposition or prime factorization is the same meaning of the word, okay? I want to give you three examples here. LCM of uh, 10 and 15 I want the LCM of 10 and 15 also I want the LCM of 9 and 18 also I need here LCM of 5 and 12 and let's know a new way about LCM First of all, decomposition and the prime, that means we should divide. On what we divide? When we see the word prime, so I want to divide them on the prime numbers. Prime numbers are numbers that add next two divisors, one and itself. And it cannot be divided, it can be divided just on one and itself. يعني الآن مثل أصلاً إلا حالة وعوان. يعني مثل عند التو عند التو عند التري عند ال 5 عند ال 7 عند ال 11 هول اكثر استعمالا نستعملهم اكثر شيء نستعملهم هول وي يوز ات وي يوز ات مور ذان ون تايم اوكي هاو وي جيت ات فيرست اوف اول اي هاف 10 اند 15 لوك وات اي ويل ميك اي ويل رايت 10 اند اي ويل رايت نيكست تو ات 15 اوكي اي ويل بوت ا كولوم نيكست تو ات اند اي ويل ستارت اي ويل ستارت تو ميك وات I will start to divide teacher. First of all, I will divide part by the first prime number that I have in the rule. What is the first one? It's two. Did you see it? Two. I will start yes. divide by two. I say for me, ten divide two equal to what? Twenty. 
Equal five. 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 Okay. I will move to the second number. Fifteen. Fifteen. It can be divided on two. No. 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 So the number that cannot be divided by two, it will be the same. I will put it down. The same. I will continue. There is more two. Can I divide more on two? No. 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 I cannot divide more on two. So I will move to three. Can I divide on a three? Of course, can I divide on three? Since fifteen is yes. divided by three. Look what I will make. Five, five, five. Divide three. It cannot be divided. I will write the five the same since it cannot be divided. Yes, I have fifteen divided three. Equal five. Five. Can I more divide on three? No, I will move the third one, that is five. Five divide five, one. And also five divide five, it's one. When I will one. write to one here in the answer, I will stop. I will look to the answers that I will get it. This column is the answer. How can I calculate it? Look what I will do. It's two times two times three there is times between them time five let's calculate it two times three six six, six times five thirty so the lcm is thirty let's move to the second one not the second one the third one yes five and the twelve who wants to make it Yes, can. Yes, Fatima Zaidan. You start by what? Yes, uh, by two. By two, divide. Two. Divide. Yes. Five divide two. Uh, miss, it, it cannot uh, become. It becomes same. five. Very good. Now twelve. Uh, and two. the four becomes uh, six. Six. six divide yes. Five. Now six divide uh, three. Oh, no, I cannot move to another number. Divide six by what? Also by two. By, by two? By two another time. I can divide it also another time by two. It will be here five, here three. Now what I will make? I will divide on what? By, by three. By three, very good. The three it becomes one. I have finished from the three. But the five it will be the same. I will divide on what? Uh, and five. Five, excellent. It will be one. Now let's move to our answer. Two times two, four. Four times three, times five. Four times three, it's a twelve. Twelve times five equals six. Sixty. You make yes. five times two, ten. Five times one, five. And so it's sixty. Yes. This is the way, the easiest way to get the LCM feature. What the meaning of a number is a multiple of another number. A multiple is a number is a multiple of another number when it's found in the table of multiplication of this number. If you look here, no need to make the time the, the composition and no need to get the LCM in, in the way of multiples. It's directly you can write the answer. The LCM is 18. Why? You know why? Since 18 is a multiple of 9. Since in the table of multiplication of 9, I have 9 times 2 give me 18. When I have a number is a multiple of another one, the greatest one is what? Is the LCM. I, give, I will give you another example. Pay attention. Maybe I get here the LCM of, of, uh, of 4 and 8. You should directly get the answer. What is the answer? Miss 8. 8. Since 8 equals... Four times two, since it, it, it's four times eight, two equal eight. Since in the table yes. of multiplication, if I get now the LCM of uh, seven and fourteen, miss fourteen the LCM because seven over two because seven times two equal two 14. equal fourteen. Seven times two fourteen. Seven times two equal fourteen. 
equal 14. That's mean. What that's mean? This writing, what's mean? Do you know what's mean? That means, that means that 14 is excellent. 14 is a what, Ya Muhammad? Is the LCM. No, 14 is the multiple. Is a multiple. A multiple yes. of seven. Yes. 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 So no need to make prime factorization in this way. Since it's directly you get the answer. LCM of, uh, let's get LCM of 6 and 36. Or 6 and 4. Miss. Miss uh, 42. 42. Since 42 because 6 times uh, 7. Equals 42. So before starting to get the LCM, first step you should look well to the number. You should look well to the denominator that I will have it. Okay, if I didn't look, okay. I cannot solve, teacher. I should look. If it's a multiple, directly I get the LCM. If it's not a multiple, directly I will make the LCM by prime factorization. 